Welcome back. There are many things in life that improve with age. Cheese, yes. a good wine, mm -hmm. your favorite suede boots, and us too. And while we don't mind getting older, we just don't want to look it. It's true. <laughs> but lasers, injections, and surgery certainly aren't for everyone. So here with her favorite non-invasive youth-boosting beauty products is Fashion Magazine's beauty editor, Sarah Daniel. <laughs> Welcome, Sarah. Thank you. Now, we love this term, non-invasive youth-boosting products, when we can say it properly. <laughs> youth-boosting products have been around for a long time. So how far have they come? They've come a very long way. There's been so much innovation and technology that's happening in beauty right now. It's really exciting. A lot of beauty brands are looking to Asia for inspiration and ideas because that market is so huge. And it's actually a great time in, to invest in skincare right now because that was a big trend on the runways for spring was no makeup. Oh. So at the Mark Jacobs show, models had only moisturizer on. That was it. So okay, <laughs> we need that dewy, dewy, dewiness. Uh -huh. dewiness. Okay. Okay. So when it comes to aging, I would say my overall main concern is just sagging, like the, the gravity just, you know, and certain lighting, yes. you're just like, okay, things are starting to go hmm. <laughs> And I want to avoid that a little bit. So what have you got here? Well, just like the muscles in your body need exercise and muscles in your face need exercise as well. Ha! Ha! Yeah, says this. Ha! High true. five. Yes. yes. Right? Okay, See? Yeah. yeah, you do. I mean, you look fabulous, but I'm saying we have to exercise our muscles. It helps that, tone and, and make your face or your skin look taut and toned. So Strivectin's actually launched what is basically like a workout for your face. It's, um, you put it on like headphones <laughs> sort of the wrong way. Okay. <laughs> and it um, creates microcurrents that stimulate the muscle to add tone and definition to your face. Okay, so you press some buttons. I'm going to try this thing on. <laughs> and try it? I'll help try you. Try it on. Okay. Hang on for one second. I know, it looks very I'm daunting. a little bit afraid. What is this going to feel like? Is it going to hurt? The, no, it does not hurt. It's, it's painless. It's, okay. It's almost like you can't even tell it's happening. So it's just <laughs> sending microcurrents to it your looks very muscles, space -age. stimulating them. <laughs> I don't feel anything. Okay, so that's all right. I do feel like it's pressing my face together like this. Is that part of the, is that what it's supposed to I think maybe you have to wear it a bit higher oh, up, yeah. but yes. <laughs> um, so hair, the oh, thinking okay. is, there, that's better, yes. I'm, I think I'm hearing my favorite song. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so the thinking is you wear it um, for 20 minutes, five times a week, yeah. and um, over the course of a few months, you'll notice a big improvement okay. in your skin. Uh, How much would something like this retail for? This is actually a, uh, $200. Okay. okay. Yeah. So while you're vacuuming or doing dishes, I would totally wear that. Yeah, yeah. that's a great idea. Two yeah, in just, one. Okay. Right? Yeah. At the same time, multitasking. Great. Okay, so an aging concern that uh, I think a lot of us have is a sagging neck because, yes. you know, you can tell a lot by somebody's neck. How do we manage that one? It's true. I think a lot of women neglect that area, but it's, it's one of the biggest signs of, of your age. And the skin in that area is really thin and delicate, so it's very susceptible to sagging and sun damage. So there's a couple of products you can use that are specifically targeting that area. One is by Elizabeth Arden. It's Privage, and it's loaded with antioxidants, firming polymers, shea butter, help with all the things like crepiness, the, the uh, darker spots that we see in that area. Another one that's great is Tarte's Maracuchu Oil. I don't even think I pronounced it correctly, but it's filled with fatty acids and vitamin C. And so the vitamin C really helps with brightening, again, targeting that sun damage that you'll see in that area. And how often do we use this? Um, well, with any skincare product, the best results will come, I think, with wearing it daily. Okay. okay. So twice a day if Feels you can, nice. but once a day, great. And so, and, and something like this, anything I use on my, my neck, I, use, I like to use here Definitely. and on the back of my hands. Exactly. That's another area. Hands will be a giveaway of your age for sure because mm -hmm. it's the same issues. It's dryness and sunspots. It's not easy. No, it is it's not. It's not easy. <laughs> <laughs> but it's worth it. Back to the face. Our next skincare product comes in the unique form of a serum. And I have to say about serums, I kind of was like, ah, serum, schmirum. But then I put one on the other day and our makeup artist noticed right away. She said, what have you got on your skin? So it, it, it was that quickly that it was a noticeable difference. It's true. Serums are great. And this one from Chanel actually has this really cool new technology. It's called micro-encapsulation, which is basically like just a really fancy way of saying it's tiny little molecules with the ingredients. It holds them and keeps them really fresh and potent so that when you actually like distribute it onto your skin, you're getting the best blast of, of the benefits. You had us at Chanel. <laughs> yes. Anyway. And serum. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> you can see the tiny little molecules in there. So you don't have to um, change your skincare routine. Can you just add the serum? And what if it's not the same brand of, of like, if it's not, everything's not Chanel. Can you just add the Chanel that's serum to totally it? That's totally fine. I think with, with layering your skincare, a lot of women do that. That's when you're going to see the best results. So you don't have to use all the same brands, but layering, starting with a serum and then a moisturizer and then maybe your eye cream after that. Okay. Okay. All right. That's good stuff. It smells good too. Uh, Sarah, I don't know if you know this about me, but Cynthia does. Um, 
Um, I do love a mask, yes. and I do try to do one a, a couple times a week, uh, but I'm really interested in these youth-boosting masks. So what do you have here for us? Well, these masks are especially cool because they're not your typical mask. You know, we're used to seeing masks that you put all over your face, but these ones are targeting specific areas. So there's one that you can put on your lips, like this one here. Oh. <laughs> so if you wear a lot of matte lipstick, you do? might feel like your lips are dry. I had no idea there was this lip is mask. This is a great you. No, I had no you. idea. Oh. <laughs> this is so, but obviously I would take it out of the package. Yes, and put take it, it out and apply it. And then just before you're going out, you know, you exfoliate, put that on, and then put your, uh, your lipstick over top, and you'll have really hydrated lips. This is great. I would, I would do this a, a couple times a week. Yes, for yes, sure. Okay. And another one is eye under eye masks. So, yeah, like, oh, okay. Yeah, hold on. Do you want me to hold it for you right now? Sure. Well, we we can do we can do it at the same time. So okay. this one we were talking about earlier. When mm -hmm. you're applying your makeup, you can have this on underneath. This has cucumber and collagen extracts in it. See, I could get behind this because I am the one who is I never have the energy or the wherewithal to put a whole face mask on. So I could do this. I would look at you. And it's I only totally, like 10 oh, yeah. to 15 minutes. And I could watch the Super Bowl like this. <laughs> <laughs> They say deflate gate. I my bag. I love it. Yeah, okay. There's also ones for nails, and this one we were nails? talking about. Yes, nails. So if you don't have any cuticle oil handy, you can just pop them on. They're almost like finger puppets for your nails. Yes. They're filled with um, botanicals and vitamins. Really oh. great for your cuticles. And for your neck as well, right? And for right? your neck as well, what we were talking about earlier. So this one from Rodeol, it um, has uh, wheat proteins, which are firming, and then hyaluronic acid, which is very hydrating. Okay. Okay, right. so now we're going to talk about wrinkles. It's something that we uh -huh. all face. At I might as well do both. I like what you're doing right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, what have you brought in to help us with those? So for wrinkles, L'Oreal has a really cool product. It's called a volume filler, and it's basically hyaluronic acid. It looks like a needle, which I know which is I kind terrifying. of daunting. See, because I kind of love it that it looks like a needle. But I'm so the idea <laughs> is <opposite>. this. <laughs> you drop it. You just do one uh, pro okay. pop there. Can I pop okay. it onto you? And that's like a really precise dosing. So I okay. think that that's one of the benefits of the packaging. It's supposed to mimic a needle, but also it's precise dosing. So you just apply it where your area is. So do it right, like right here. Yeah, here right and also here. under and it'll the eye. Fill it in at lines. Here. Okay, yes. and yeah, a and bit. it'll it'll help hydrate the area. I'm gonna be 20 by the time you're finished, Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> So, and then the other product I brought was the um, Hourglass product. This is actually a foundation that you would apply after putting on most of your skincare, but it gives you that extra boost of hyaluronic acid, so that's helping to smooth lines and wrinkles. It also has um, pearlized pigments, so it makes your skin look really glowy, um, because as you get older, sometimes you have like a more dull complexion, so this gives you a little bit of a boost. And there's like an the SPF in glow. there. Yes, exactly. Oh, SPF in there. Yeah, a little bit of SPF, 15. That's lovely. Yeah. It's good. Yeah, I, I like it. it's a little luminescent. Mm -hmm. Okay, lastly, we're going to talk about something that targets the whole body. I never even knew this existed. Drinkable beauty supplements. Yes. This sounds very interesting. This is a huge trend right now. I think it's been driven by this obsession with juice bars and, and fresh, freshly pressed juices. So this is a Canadian company. It's called Fountain, and they've created these supplements that you can add to smoothies, juice, whatever. And they're, they read like the back of your serum or moisturizer. They have hyaluronic acid, collagen, resveratrol, which is like a super high power antioxidant. You just mix it into your drink and you're good to go. Okay. 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 And I think I was supposed to talk about this one first. Okay, yeah, this yeah. is actually Elle McPherson's product. It's um, something that her doctor developed for her. Elle McPherson the body? Yes. Give she's it to in me. She's her 50s. She looks amazing, <laughs> yes. right? It's like, what are you doing? This is what she's doing. She's adding two teaspoons a day to coconut water. And it basically has a lot of Chinese herbs, vitamins, minerals, pre and probiotics. It's just packed with amazing So we just stuff. drink this. We wouldn't okay. drink this the whole we, bottle. We just, mix. This one you mix, and yeah. this one we do a little we shot. We do a little shot. shot yeah. Let's do okay. that. We like shooters on this show. Yes. Cheers. Cheers, Cheers. to beauty. Thank you, Cheers. Sarah. Thank you for having me. Cheers to everyone. Thank you for attending the social.ca at today's show for a recap of all these great youth boosting products. And make sure you check out the February issue of Fashion Magazine, which is on newsstands right now.